How's it going, everybody? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawlhalla for you today, as always. Hope you're all having a beautiful day, wherever you might be. So, we have some beautiful new things to show off in the world of Brawlhalla today, starting with the star of the show, Fiendish Knight Roland. This kind of came out of nowhere, and I love it. It actually almost makes him look like like a vampire or I don't even know like what it looks like but it just gives off such a cool vibe and maybe like a boss in Dark Souls or something. I love the sword with the purplish edge and the lance looks really cool too. We're gonna definitely be playing the skin pretty much the entire uh, episode today so if you like Sir Roland and you're into that definitely drop a like on this video because it's going to be epic and we also have a new sidekick Twilly so cute! We're definitely going to get that. Oh wait. Item already owned, but yet I just bought it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and then last but not least, we have a new taunt. The peace signs taunt. I don't know if I want to get it or not. I'm still on the fence about it, but for now, I'm just going to look at it and show it to you guys. But let's go ahead and equip the Twilly before I forget because I don't want to forget. There we go. Alright, we got Twilly. The T-Rex uh, was from a previous video, so let's go ahead and change it up. Uh, let's do Master Shifu. I really like that one. All right, let's jump into some games, guys. All right, we're going to play some Ranked 1v1, and we're going to go ahead and use Fiendish Knight Roland. Let's go. Uh, there he is. So let's take a look at all the colors. You guys can judge for yourself whether it looks good or bad. Personally, I think most of those colors look pretty cool. I just wish that the horn, the unicorn horn on his forehead, it looks like it was just kind of stuck on there. It doesn't look like it was like grown out of his skull. You know what I mean? I, th I think they, they could have done a little bit better than that on the horn, but I think for the first game, let's just go ahead and use Skyforge. That looks so good. Hmm. That looks good. Maybe we'll use default colors next time, actually, because I do want to play at least one game with the default colors. All right, here we go. Going against Unseen. Ooh, a Jiro in Ranked? Interesting. Usually, most people don't play Jiro in Ranked because he has such low defense, but Jiro is a really good legend. I respect it. Oh, man. Fiendish Knight rolling, though. Not sure how this is going to go, to be honest. I'm not used to fighting a Scythe with a Lance because I don't play a ton of Lance, but I have been, like, warming up to it. I do like it more than I used to. All right, I guess we're going unarmed. Don't underestimate the power of the spike ball. <laughs> it can be useful just to slow, slow them down, if anything. Man, we are fighting this battle mostly in the air. This, is <laughs> this reminds me of Rocket League. I see you. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Feels good when you get a perfect hit with the weapon throw for the KO. I think this matchup, it favors Sir Roland just because I have a lot more defense. Um, I love that move. You know, basically, he has to hit me twice for every time I hit him once almost, you know? So, it's just not working out like that. We're pretty much trading blows for the most part, which gives me an advantage. Oh, he's trying to hit me with those things! Oh, what a dodge. Oh man, we're getting a pretty good second stock here. Oh, let's go. We got him in the deep red. That was a nice finish on him. Look at Twilly. Twilly is actually huge. Way bigger than I thought Twilly would be. But yeah, we're, we're in a pretty good position here to win already. I just have to not choke. <laughs> Which can happen, especially against a Scythe player when you're off edge. So you gotta be really careful. No! No! See what I mean? Oh, we're fine. We're fine. He's not giving up. Oh, Unseen. You gotta watch out for that Lance. We got a little bit of a lead still. And uh, hopefully... We can take out this stock and just win the game right here. I see that mine. I see what you're doing there. No, I still almost got hit into it. Oh, I love hitting that down sig. I hit it so many times. 
Unseen is not bad, like he's really good with the sword and he has shown that he's also really good with the sight. So I gotta be very careful, especially those down sigs. Ooh, nice down sig. I didn't think it would actually hit me because I thought I was too close. If he would have done a side sig, I would have expected it, but either one would have hit me and killed me to be honest. You gotta give him respect for even using Jiro in rank 1v1. I mean, that takes a little bit of courage. Unless you're phase on or something, you know. <laughs> he's, he's like just insane at the game though. Oh, let's go, baby. First game with Fiendish Knight rolling is a win. Well played, dude. Well played. I normally don't really play rank 1v1 after I get diamond, so I've never really seen how far I could go. But I do beat people that are like 2200, 2300 ELO pretty often in experimental, so I think that's where I would be. So not too surprised if I can win some games here, but let's go ahead and do one game with classic colors, I guess, just so we can see what it looks like kind of in, a, in an actual game. And if you guys enjoy the video, please drop a like. Really appreciate it. All right. Going against Asael. That's a pretty cool name. Um, playing as a black Diana, Crypto Mage Diana, with a Skyforged bow, which is really cool. Oh, yeah, he has honor. Alright, so this time we're going against the Legend with two completely different weapons from the last one. So this is going to be quite a bit of a different match. But honestly, I feel like I can win against any weapon pretty much with Lance and Sword and Sir Roland just because Sir Roland is such a good legend. Like look at that, he hit me so many times on the edge I can still get back. Lance side air is crazy, but Lance recovery does get you killed sometimes if they break your recovery. Oh yeah, let's get it! I love the look, the black Crypto Mage, Skyforge bow. Oh, get down there, Diana, let's go! Absolutely dunked! She's not doing bad, like her, oops. Didn't mean to do that, <laughs> she punished well, see? Like, she's punishing my mistakes, but sometimes... Let me help you up, Diana. Sometimes I feel like she's just letting me get hits. Uh, ooh, that was a nice one. I figured he was going to do that ground pound, and he did. Alright. We still got a pretty decent lead. As long as we maintain the lead, I'm not sweating it. And even, honestly, if we're fighting from behind, I'm not sweating it. I always just never give up. If you guys have watched my channel, you know I just never give up. Oh my goodness, if that down air would have hit, I would have been toast. But look, we reversed. Oh, that was so close. I can't believe he almost got back there. These weapons look so cool, though, don't you guys think? That last stock, we went from almost dying to getting the stock ourselves. Like, And I had Lance off stage. You just gotta be very careful, but it can be a pretty good offstage weapon. Boom. Oh! I smell it! Oh! GG! We got him! Oh man, he was at 1999 ELO. Dang, that was such a close... <laughs> you can't get any closer than that. I hope you get Diamond, bro. If you haven't already. If you don't know, Diamond is 2000 ELO, so he's only one off. Alright. Um, hmm, what should we do for our next? I kind of want to do Charged OG. Just because it looks crazy, but it kind of scares me even, so I don't want to do that. Um, should I go black? It looks so crazy. I don't know if I want to do it. All right, let's do at least one game with black, I guess. It's so dark. All right, here we go. Going against Iruki and Petra. Petra's a really good legend. I got to be careful against Petra. The gauntlets and the orb. Both of those weapons can shred. Whoa. 
She didn't want to taunt at the beginning, which is fine. I always taunt to say like, good luck, have fun. And I think most people understand that, but yet they still don't taunt back. I don't know why. Oh man, she good. Those are some nice gauntlet strings. Like I said, Petra, you gotta be careful. You can go from white to red health very quickly. But not good enough! Let's go! <laughs> she was like destroying me and we reversed. That was good. Wait for it. Gotta be very careful. Try not to do anything that's gonna get you punished. And anytime they miss an attack, don't always go in for the punish. Sometimes wait and see what they do after the miss. Because if you go in every single time right after they miss, They'll expect it, and then they might decoy miss. Do a fake miss, and then lure you into that punish, and then punish you. Woo! Oh! We're both deep red, but I got a whole stock on her. This is looking good. Oh! I missed on the first one, and I thought she was going to punish. She tried to punish, but then it was, like, just too late. The best part about that Lance Neutral Sig is how many different dodges it covers. They can dodge right, dodge neutral, dodge left, it'll hit them off. Wow, her recovery, or I mean her Neutral Sig beat my ground pound, but I guess it is a signature. Alright, we got a pretty good lead here. She's already in orange, her final stock. But, oh, that was that was almost the game again! Good dodging from Petra here. If she keeps dodging like, like, okay. She's like one good hit. GG dude, GG, that was a good game. He came off so strong too. Alright, I think one more game, right? One more game for Fiendish Knight Sir Roland. We're doing pretty good. Um, so I got esports colors? I actually really like community colors. Frozen Forest looks really good too. Hmm. Tough choice, tough choice. I think I'm gonna have to go... Hmm. Let's go Frozen Forest, why not? It looks pretty cool. Alright, here we go. Going against a cross. Cross is actually super scary to fight. Uh, a good cross. Man. One of my friends, Emperor Freed, he's like number one cross in the world. He's so scary. So I, whenever I see a cross, I think of him. And I, I remember getting my butt beat many times from a cross. So I have to be very careful here. He's one of those legends that like a lot of people don't play. But the people that do play him are just cracked at the game, you know? <laughs> it's one of those. So you gotta be very careful you see a cross in diamond. Oh, oh. Must go. Oh, home run, baby. That was some pretty clean edge guarding there. We keep playing like this. We are gonna cruise to victory, but never underestimate, like I keep saying. I don't care if I'm up. I'm not like a uh, Sir Roland or Lance main, but I have been growing to like like Lance a lot more. Oh. Oh. Wow, we're doing all right. I think if I really pushed rank, I could probably get pretty high elo, but I usually just play for fun. I don't like playing rank that much because people try so hard. And also, it's so... Like, more more toxic people are in ranked, I feel like, but... Ooh, nice down sig. Gravity cancel. Alright, so he's in orange already, last stock. We should have this, but you never know when, when you're fighting across. I got no weapon. There we go. Oh, I missed him by an inch! Alright, I gotta damage him up. Because he's looking like he wants to take this stock, which he might. So I got to get him as deep into red as I can. So that way, if I do go to my last stock, it should be like one hit to kill him. Ooh, that was a good hit. He's looking at a reverse. 
three stock. Okay, he's in deep red. He is doing a really good job trying to get this reverse three stock, but... Oh, wrong input, Lucian! You would expect it, though, at this rank, to be honest. This, this rank, we're pretty high elo. We're, you know, people don't give up usually at this high. They're gonna fight hard no matter what. Close. You gotta give him respect. That was so close. GG, dude. GG, well played. He almost brought it all the way back. But he didn't, and we got the win. Feels good, man. What is that, like four wins in a row? Man, we went from 2000 to 2086 pretty fast. Well, anyways, guys, that was Fiendish, Night Roland, and Twilly, the the cutest sidekick possibly. Other than, uh, nah, you know what? I like I like Twilly, but Kitsune is still my favorite. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you aren't already, and if you enjoy Brahalla and Rocket League content. And as always, I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.